I came to the Live to Lead conference because I was interested in perfecting my leadership style and skills. What I took from the program today is not just learning how to lead, but also how to be led and how to interact with people in my day-to-day -day life. Well, I am a member of the John Maxwell's team. I'm a speaker, coach, and trainer with John Maxwell. And one of the things that encouraged me to come was to listen to him because he's always having cutting edge information in terms of leadership. And one of the things he talked about today was growth. So even though I have some training and some expertise, I wanted to grow. I would recommend this program to anyone that wants to make their lives better. It's not just about leadership, but it's also about making your life better. And you can you do that through the terms of leadership. And even when I was working with our young people, it was about, hey, don't stop coming. You come today as a youth, but then we want you to continue to come as you become a young adult and as you become older. So don't stop growing. I attended the Live to Lead conference because as a business owner, I wanted to Hear from those that are at the top. One of the things I've learned is you have to follow people that's where you want to be. And so listen to John Maxwell and Simon Sinek. I wanted to hear from those experts how I can get to the next level. I would recommend this program times 10. Um, everything I learned and heard today is not just about motivation, it's about drive and determination and giving you the energy to move forward and to continue to walk in your dreams. I attended the Live to Leave conference for two reasons. One is a friend of mine was the keynote presenter and I came to support him. And secondly, because I'm in a different spot now leading my own firm and I wanted to be able to take it to the next level of leadership. People can take a lot from the Live to Lead conference. I would say, you know, it covers so many aspects of leadership. It covers, you know, how to be led by somebody else. It covers how to um, pursue your calling and to completely live that out in the workplace. And it also covers some things about you that might be seen as strengths, but could also um, deter you from being a good leader and discourage the people that you manage. I wholeheartedly recommend this program Live to Lead to anyone else because uh, you're constantly growing as a leader and it's really easy to think that you're doing a really good job but you need to sometimes see different perspectives and to understand that in business and in life you're always on a journey you can always learn more. Hi, I'm Adrian Whitaker and I'm the co-chair of Live to Lead Richmond which was hosted by the Federal Reserve Bank of Richmond and Urban Financial Services Coalition. When someone asks me, what is the Live to Lead conference about in Richmond? You know, there's so many things that come to my mind. First of all, it's an opportunity for us to be able to come together as individual leaders in this market and be able to share with each other. It's an opportunity for us to hear from wonderful national speakers. And then it's an opportunity also for us to celebrate the individuals who give of their time and their energy in our community as true leaders, just giving back. But for me personally, Live to Lead Richmond is a journey. And it's a journey that started with me over 15 years ago when I first started with the Urban Financial Services chapter here in Richmond, Virginia. That chapter, our chapter, gave me an opportunity to grow my leadership skills. And today, to have the chapter now have a conference that is sold out, not one year, but two years, when it's all about growing and developing leaders, it says it all for me. And it's the reason why I give my time to the Live to Lead Conference Richmond.